Hey y'all, so today I'm back with a tag video and I'm going to show you how I spray. I was tagged by the beautiful creator of this tag, Ms. Takara Thompson. If you're not already following her, I will definitely leave her information down below and make sure you watch her video. She created this tag. And also, if you want to do this tag, make sure you do it and let me know so that I can watch her video as well. I do want to quickly introduce myself for those of you who may be new here. My name is Aisha. I make videos about fragrance, beauty, luxury, and lifestyle. If those are things you're into, please make sure you go ahead and subscribe now. And if you are a returning subscriber, hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. So before we get started, I do want to mention that I am in my workout room in my house because this is like the only place where I get good lighting and I can stand up so y'all can see me. <laughs> like I have enough space where you can see me on camera. So Hopefully the echo is not too bad, um, but there might be some echo. So please forgive, but I really wanted to do this standing up because that's how I spray my fragrances. So of course I have showered. Um, that is always the first step in my fragrance routine. So I shower, I put on my regular after shower oil that I use. I didn't bring it down here with me because it's upstairs in my bathroom and it's messy. So I will insert a picture of it here, but you can use any type of moisturizer that you like. I typically always use a unscented moisturizer just initially when I get out of the shower because at that point I'm really just trying to lock in the moisture. However, I was sent this product from Rituals and they sent me all of this. This is a beautiful scented gift set. It comes with a body wash, a body cream, a body scrub, and a hand soap. All of these are scented in the same scent, which is Sakura, which is like cherry blossom. So if I was wearing a fragrance that is similar to this, then I would use these products. So if I know that I'm going to be wearing a cherry blossom scent, then I would use the body wash of cherry blossom and the body cream of cherry blossom prior to me putting on my fragrance. However, most times I don't pick my fragrance until I am fully dressed. Um, but I did want to share this with you guys because it is an awesome set and I know Sephora sale is coming up. This is offered at Sephora as well and I have used the hand cream. I haven't used the other products in here yet. But the hand cream or the body cream I actually really like, so I would recommend this. The other products I haven't really used yet. I'm kind of saving them for a day when I actually wear cherry blossom fragrance, but I did want to share it with you guys anyway. So most days, like I said, I just apply my regular unscented moisturizer and then I get dressed, decide what fragrance I'm going to wear. And from there, I will apply another moisturizer on my arms. If I have a scented product that goes with whatever fragrance I chose, then I will use that at that time. However, if I don't have a scent to go with it, then I will take a regular old unscented lotion. This one is from Target. It's the Up and Up brand Extra Repair. I do really like this. It is a cheap lotion, but it actually works really well. And what I'll do with this is apply a little bit in my hands, like that much, that's all I need. I will take my fragrance, which today I'm going to be using this one from Valentino. This is Donna Aqua, and this is a light scent. So I will spray just usually about two to three sprays in my hands with the lotion. Mix that up and apply it on my arms. Now I typically only do this like on my arms or maybe my chest if it's out. Because like I said, I'm already moisturized, but this is really just to get some extra scent to myself. So after that's done, then I will go on with spraying my fragrance. Now today I'm using a light fragrance, but I'll kind of, as I go through my step-by-step -step fragrance spraying, I'll tell you what I would do if it's light, moderate, or heavy fragrance. So first I'll show you what I would do if I was using a heavy fragrance. So something that projects loudly or that is just really potent, this is what I would do with a heavy fragrance. I would spray here, 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 here. I do not count my sprays, I just have my routine. So there, and then I'll spray once in the back of my neck. And if it's a heavy spray fragrance, I'll usually just do one of these numbers and step through it. <laughs> now, if it's a moderate fragrance, meaning it's kind of in between, then I would do all of that. Plus, I would also do 
this number here and this number here. If I am wearing a dress and it's a heavy fragrance, then I would spray my legs. Don't typically do that if it's a moderate fragrance and I'm not wearing a dress, but like I said, if I am wearing a dress, then I will do that. Now, if it's a lightweight fragrance like what this is, <laughs> then I feel like I can go ham. So I do all of that, what I just showed you, plus <laughs> I'll do this, this, this. So I'll spray extra on my arms. I will definitely spray more on my shirt and then I will definitely spray my legs. And I typically like to spray around my knees and that's pretty much it for me. So with a light fragrance, I'll spray everywhere even if I'm not wearing a dress. So hopefully it makes sense to you guys. I am an over sprayer, but not as much as some people, but this is just where I do that I find works for me. Also, I kind of forgot to mention, but every now and again, I will spray my hair. Don't do that all the time, but sometimes I do. I'm not gonna do it today, but if, well, I'll do it today for you guys. <laughs> if I spray my hair, I do like one of these. And that's it. <laughs> Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you did this tag video as well, or, or if you want to do it, let me know so I can go and watch yours as well. I tag everyone watching who wants to do it. So thank you again to Cara for tagging me and for creating this tag. If you guys are not already subscribed to my channel, please do it now. Please give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. And please make sure you follow me on Instagram for more content. I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.